Who's this? Listen to me carefully. They've sent someone to kill you. Yeah, I know. Who is this? We have a mutual friend, Ingram. All right, what do I do? All right, where to now? Do you see the alley on your left? Yeah. Go into it. All right, I'm here. 247. Where are you? Who are you trying to impress? You're not a fucking tough guy. I can see right through that silent hero bullshit. <laughs> I'm having a ball. I could do this all day. But feel free to tap out any time, huh? Just say the word, man. Isn't Cloak supposed to send somebody in today? A chick? Rebecca Fields. Hmm. <laughs> Becky, meet Dick. Listen, I should tell you about Fields. Don't talk to her like you do other women. What are you babbling about? Just trust me. If you have any sense of self-preservation, just stay clear of her. Is he awake? I'm not sure. Well, I hope you enjoyed your cowboy shit because it's over. Excuse me. He's ready to talk. Yes. I'm on my way.
Anthony Lowe. I'm Mark Sullivan. Why don't you come with me? I heard you out of work. I'd like to offer you something. What's the catch? There is none. I'm sure you're aware of current events. What's been happening to our people? Our people? Killers. Like you and me. Someone's hunting us. One by one. Why? We don't know. Who they are, why they're after us, who hired them, no one knows. So that's the catch. What is? You want me to help you find out? You took your sweet time getting here. Wait, she's here now. Scotland's dead. Did you know that? My condolences. You bitch. Blake, calm down. How did he die? He was a sniper. And they got away. No, they did not. The sniper was found dead nearby. Who killed the sniper? Whoever it was did us a favor. What are we going to do about we're looking into the identity of the sniper. Hopefully that will lead us to whoever hired them. In the meantime, everything will proceed as planned. Rebecca, you'll be taking over Scotton's place. Fields. This is bullshit. Thank you, sir. I'll get to work immediately. Senator and all. So, logically, I am the next best candidate. We are going to find out who hired that sniper. But you won't. You need my help to help you find and kill her. You need my help? Is that what this is? Was she helping you? Am I here to replace her? I promise you, that is not it. Okay? She was killed during an assignment, just like the rest of us. We, we, have to stop this together. You're using me. I'm giving you a chance for revenge. If you go out alone, he will kill you. I can guarantee that. Excuse me. Why did you feel it was necessary for you to come here? Because your man fucked up. My man took care of your target. And wound up dead for cloak to find. Do you realize this is a problem for the both of us? I've lost three people. How exactly is this your problem? they're able to trace it back to you, they get closer to me. They won't. I have another issue. 
Another job. What? Blake Morris. He's beginning to suspect me. No. That will only draw more suspicion. He's a problem to me, alive. I gotta deal with this ghost that's been killing off my crew. Like you said, it's both our problems. I want Morris dead. Today. It's gonna cost you double. And why is that? I'm putting two men on this assignment. We want it done right. No loose ends. You get nothing until the job is done. No loose ends. So you're the new guy, huh? And you are? Headshot. Anthony. Anthony. I'm done hiding. Fair enough. What do you know about this guy we're after? He's already killed three of us. No civilians? Only assassins. Senator Blake Morris. Got to where he was today with help from Cloak. If you accept the money for taking a life, you're no doubt familiar with them. Constantine has chosen Morris as his golden boy with plans to put him in the Oval Office. When he's not busy making the world a better place, he spends time with his four-year-old son. Arch, his bodyguard. Morris moves with a tight crew. He prefers local mob types if he has a uh, history with them. It'll be easy. We have an insider with a constant watch on Morris and his whereabouts. Headshot will take care of Morris. He'll be his backup. You're setting a trap? Damn right. All of our people were killed during assignment. He'll be there. Be ready. You knew Malice? Yeah. She was a good assassin. Let's focus on the task at hand. Let's get this over with. See you around. Headshot have made contact. Headshot.
Where's Morris? Stay put, I'm coming over. What? Morse got away. He was expecting us. There was no sign of our killer. He didn't show. I know. How? I want you and Headshot to meet me at the rendezvous point. No one else, just the two of you. you? Of course not. What's going on? Ballistic's dead. What? He wasn't on an assignment. He was at Fields' place. What was he doing at Fields' place? Keeping tabs. Keeping tabs. How do you know it's him? Who else would it be? Ballistic was one of the best. No one else could have caught him off guard. He knows our moves. What? He knew we were setting a trap. If Morris could figure it out, so could he. You think it's one of us? Sullivan. He's someone close. There's only us. What about your insider? With Cloak? He's my guy. It's not him. Why is Morris still alive? Why didn't you do it? The job was simple. You drew too much suspicion to yourself. They were waiting for us. The whole situation is fucked. Cloak is gonna come after me now. You owe me protection. No. We're in the same boat. You created this. Keep me alive or you get nothing, understand? 
Go to the safe house. We'll talk. Sir, with all due respect, Fields has to go. She put a hit on me. How sure are you? God damn it, it was her. We had a little chat this morning. A rather heated one. I expected someone to come for me tonight, and I was dead fucking right! Are you familiar with Mark Sullivan? No. He's one of the best assassins in the world. The sniper who killed Scott and is one of his protégés. If Rebecca is behind all this, there's no doubt she's working with Sullivan. Then we kill all of them. Rebecca will be dealt with. As for Sullivan and his team, we can buy them out. What? They'll be useful. They killed Scott and they killed my men. Rebecca is responsible for all of their deaths. These assassins are merely tools. Soon they'll be ours to use. Do not make this personal. Fields has to die. She will. Those assassins failed in eliminating you, so she'll most likely seek protection. We'll send the Reapers. What do they know? Didn't take them long to lick malice to you. They also know that Fields is behind everything. What's the plan? They're gonna kill Fields by midday. They figured you'd protect her, so they're sending the Reapers. I stay clear. There has been a development. What? Constantine likes you. He wants you to work for him. Good. And Morris isn't too happy about that. You killing his men and all. He wants you all dead. But Constantine's not going to allow that. I'll give you the location where Fields is hiding. Let the Reapers have an easy one. Mr. Sullivan. Mr. Constantine, it's a pleasure. You know what we do, and we know what you do. So, are we in agreement we should work together? Absolutely. I want there to be absolutely no animosity between us, any of us. Blake, shake his hand. This is a mistake, sir. Blake, shake his hand. Past the past? Lest we forget. 
Good. From here on, we move forward together. I hear you've been having some trouble lately. We're being hunted. Yes, an assassin who's hunting other assassins. Well, we specialize in finding people. We'll help you with this problem. I appreciate that. You do the same thing every night. What is it exactly that you're contemplating? You have no right to be here. It doesn't matter, I still could have killed you. <laughs> you think. Truthfully, I was half expecting to find you the same way I found ballistic. If I can get in here and detect it, so could he. You don't really care about whether you live or die, do you? Are you my therapist now? No, I want to know what drives you. We are on the same side. You keep trying to tell me we're on the same side and we want the same thing. We're not the same. We kill people for a living. That's where similarities end. Why do you do it? Why do you? There are bad people in this world. We need to get rid of them. What makes you think we're not bad people? We do what is necessary. Killing is a part of life, whether it's for food, survival, defending those we care about. We kill for the greater good. You think we're doing the world a favor? This partnership with Cloak is a blessing. Now we will have more power and we'll use it for good. You betrayed fields and fed her to the wolves. You use people. Whatever it is that you're planning, it's not as righteous as you say it is. I won't let you manipulate me into fighting your war. You can't deny that you have a stake in this either. The man who killed your ex-wife. Do it for her. Why do you want him dead? We are the true heroes of our time. He stands between us and our purpose. To bring peace into this world. After I kill him, you and I are done. What's this? Roland Burke. Ingram found him in Cloak's database. You think this is him? I know it's him. Alright. We kill him tonight. Do you know where Mark is? Burke. Can't believe it was him the whole time. I used to work with them. Do you have a problem with killing him? Of course not. Sullivan told me about Malice. I'm sorry. Let's just find him and kill him. She didn't talk much about her past. I had no idea. You speak about your past? Only when the time's most appropriate. Sullivan was wrong. Not hard to imagine. Sorry. 
Why are you sorry? I'm sorry about Malice. You didn't kill her. I truly am sorry. About everyone. But it had to be done. I said I only talk about my past at the most appropriate time. This is the most appropriate. I was a victim of your kind. I learned what true evil was. Destroying lives. For profit. You're monsters. You in particular. I find interesting. You don't know why you're a monster. You just are. And now you have to die. Just like everyone else. them to feel betrayed, deceived. I want them to feel the pain and wrath of every victim they've ever claimed. Don't do anything stupid, Senator. Although I know how hard that is for you. What do you want? Obviously not to kill you. I apologize for yesterday. I had to keep up appearances for Sullivan. But things have changed. Sullivan? Are you turning on him? You know who I am now. I require someone with similar goals. You want Sullivan and his whole crew dead? Yes. Yeah, but that's not up to me. Constantine... Constantine will do nothing. He's too smart. You're gonna take it to the ultimate power. A slap on the wrist is the most you'll ever get. It's much more important than these group of assassins. What do you get out of this? Their extinction. I need your help to make that happen. I'm gonna have to think about this. I want to hear from you in the morning. And remember, don't do anything stupid. It only takes one second for someone to die. killed her with my bare hands. Thank you. For what, saving your life? Yeah. You're welcome. I know this place. The tower building. 
One of the perks of being partners with Cloak. Stop dreaming, Sullivan. We're not partners. They own us. And we own this place. Things change. What now? The plan hasn't changed. Everything's changed. I can't trust your judgment anymore. Not after everything that's happened. All the people who've died on your watch. They were my people. Hands off the boss, Mr. Lowe. We've been tracking Headshot. You've been wrong before. He had all of us fooled. But now we got him cornered. He's more dangerous than you think. Will that stop you? I'm being realistic. We're gonna need more people. All of our people are dead. Gets worse. Well, well. What's this mean? It means we're outnumbered. And outgunned. Morris lives in a protective bubble. With Headshot joining him in there, we're not going to be able to reach him. Not to mention all the manpower Morris has access to. Including the Reapers. I thought we were all supposed to be cool now. It didn't take much convincing for Morris to come after us. So now we're fucked? Follow me. What do you want? I want to see if your training's paid off. What are you talking about? I need you out in the field with me. We found a killer. We're all killers, Sullivan. That's right. And we're going to do what is necessary. Enough of your bullshit, Sullivan. We are not superheroes. You can walk off this anytime you like. You'd be rotting in a shit-infested alley if it wasn't for me. You challenge my views, but you're following my path. So, if you want to quit, then quit. How old are you? No younger than we were when we first started. We can't risk his life. I can take care of myself. And who are you, anyway? He's here to help. And you? Brett has proven to be quite the prodigy. He will be useful. He's too eager to take a life. That's what I do best. And that's why you do it. Isn't that why you do it? That's why you're here, right? To help? Because helping Sullivan means a lot of people are gonna die. Enough. Let's get to work. You're just the kid who thinks he's angry. You want to know who I am? I'll show you. As for you and Headshot, I don't know who's worse. Be thankful you're not the one I'm after.
That was the last time I saw her. Sullivan already told me. Were you supposed to save her? I was supposed to kill her. Now, I have only one thought. He took her from me. Do not underestimate them. They'll go through your client's men as easy as last time. You need astounding numbers. Spread the word. I want every hitman, ex-military, ex-con, every thug, low-life piece of shit. Even every psychopath. Anyone willing to walk into a bloodbath. You got that? They will be angry, driven by twisted morality. Tonight, they all die. As long as the money's up front. I was good, you'd be hard to try out organization. Just show me who to kill. It's time. On the other side, a more peaceful world awaits. Shit. This is what we prepared for. You're crazy. They're sending everyone. Then everyone's gonna die. Ah! 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 Ah!
against Constantine's orders. You of all people should know the repercussions. My son. He was gonna kill my son. Yes. Son. After I kill you, you'll have to go too. You stupid fuck. If I die, Constantine will wipe all the rest of you off this fucking planet. Not likely. A senator who never wanted to move up the presidency, dragging Cloak's plans for years and years. Your plan A. Plan A's dead. Cloak is moving in a bright new direction. Constantine's getting too old and tired for all this. He needs us. Me. To take Cloak to a bright new age. Us getting rid of you? It's just everything going according to plan. You're full of shit. You're gonna end up just like Fields. Hmm, yes, Fields. What you don't realize, Senator, is that it was all part of the plan. Fuck you. going alone. Sure you are. If you come with me, you'll die. If I don't go with you, you'll die. Look, I'm not doing this for Solomon. My whole family was killed in front of me. I never found the men responsible. I don't know if I ever will. Until then, everyone is responsible. Everyone pays. You people believe what you're doing is good, but you're severely wrong. You're puppets. But you will try to justify yourself. You kill to satisfy your bloodlust. You kill because you love to. You're right. I'm unarmed. Kill me! If you can.
Where's Sullivan? At the conference? And Brett? He went home. How'd it go? According to plan, Constantine's son Alistair's new head of cloak. I don't know why you're so pleased with this news. You will. In time. So, what else is there? Unfinished business. With who? The Morris family. One last thing. That night Ballistic was killed. Same night Headshot and I were supposed to take out Morris. Headshot was with me the whole time. He didn't kill Ballistic. He couldn't have. Even I thought it was strange at the time. Mark Sullivan is being outdone by just one man. <laughs>